Hello, hello, and welcome back to Leaky Gaming, and welcome back to Staropol's Kaviesh. Uh, yeah, this is, uh, as promised, this is gonna be a new series. I don't know how long it's gonna be. There's not much to do, because uh, I think it's perfect. Uh, I'm gonna be doing this off-screen, time-lapse, I'm gonna do a lot of stuff. Uh, mostly it's gonna be, well, some of the jobs will be repetitive, as we don't have animals. Uh, some of the jobs will be... Uh, off screen maybe there's not gonna be bailing at least uh, not in the beginning and uh, what else uh, yeah that's about it uh, looks like both of our fields are growing so we're gonna start uh, so yeah <clears throat> small introduction to this sorry about that uh, we're gonna be doing this farm uh, as it's meant to be we're gonna do we're gonna have arable fields maybe later on we're gonna get some animal type but not really sure we'll see about that uh, for now I'm gonna be using as far as I know I might be using the same equipment here I'll check if I have any uh, polish one I know that I have a subsolar polish one metal tech and uh, metal tech sorry and this one is Polymag could be. I'm not sure if this is a Polish one, but um, uh, we can we can do better than this. Um, right. So for now, we're gonna do the first episode with the equipment we have here. Uh, so I would say that uh, first things first. I think we have to uh, fertilize our, our fields. We have two fields, and this is gonna be done quite fast because this is a small map. So if we remove this, if we remove this, we can see that uh, our fields have zero fertilizing stage. So that means, okay, let's go to the first person view. Let's start driving this bad boy. Okay. Okay, we're doing well. Okay, so what we're gonna do now, we're gonna attach our fertilizer spreader and I'm pretty sure that it doesn't have any fertilizer in it. Uh, usually it doesn't because it's, um, well, why not? It's gonna make us work for it. But uh, like I said, this map is pretty small and um, uh, the shop is not far away. So yes, of course it's empty. Okay, uh, what I'm gonna do now, yeah, let's keep it on screen. I'm gonna have to have a map here because I'm not sure. Yeah, I think uh, because it's not set on the map where the shop is, I'm gonna take this there. It's a little bit big, it's a little bit on the big side. We'll see when we get to the shop, maybe we're gonna sell it and buy something smaller. But not really sure. Let's try to do this. I think it's on the left here. Yes, there's a shop. Okay, a little bit muddy, let's go to the first person view. Um, I'm surprised that this can hold this uh, fertilizer spreader, it's pretty big, but then again this Fiat is quite quite amazing, amazing machine. Yeah, it looks like I'm gonna have to adjust the sensitivity on the um, steering wheel because... Uh, the, the um, dead angle or whatever it's called it's a little bit off it takes me a while to start rotating okay I'll see you guys in a sec okay this is much better okay uh, let's see what we can do here so let's see the shop uh, we have a fertilizer technology that I would like to see what we have I would definitely would like to I would definitely would like I would like to get rid of this um, uh, <clears throat> fertilizer spreader here I mean we might no no I'm not gonna go with lime anytime soon so let's go with the small caverna land uh, even though come on like uh, let's face it coon is amazing one and uh, let's just sell it straight away uh, garage we're gonna go to this one yes 14,000 uh, actually that's gonna earn us some money that's not bad uh, and let's go with this one uh, just buy it yes Okay, uh, we're gonna buy one pallet of uh, fertilizer. Where, if I was fertilizer, oh, well, maybe we have big bags as well, yes. <clears throat> so let's see the price. Solid fertilizer, 2,000 euros, uh, genetics bag. So this is a little bit cheaper. It has twice the fertilizer. Um, yeah, yeah, you know what, let's let's just stick to this one. 
uh, buy that one. Yes, okay. So, we are a sole Polish farmer who's trying to survive in this cruel world. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have, we need to catch up with uh, Western agricultural technologies. So, we need to do a little bit more work than usual. So, we're gonna have to invest in equipment. We're gonna have to, oh yeah, I forgot that this has to be lifted over it. And uh, the problem is, oh no, okay. <clears throat> I was thinking that the, the the hook can be only attached to front, and but no, it can be attached to the back as well. I have a mod for that, but th that, that's a story for another time. Okay, so let's go back to the fields and let's do some um, the fertilizer spreading. And, uh, and let's see how this is going to work out. Right. So, uh, we have uh, two of our fields that need to be fertilized, and we're gonna see what we're gonna do next. Uh, there's a lot of a lot of equipment uh, the, um, in order to do uh, arable farming, uh, for example, for sugar beets, for uh, potatoes, all that stuff. Corn, for example, we don't have anything for corn. And, okay, I was scared, I was... My heart stopped for a minute there because I thought that our field that we just grew, but it's not. Um, this is our field here, I believe so. So let's start spreading fertilizer. This shouldn't take long. Okay, maybe we should have changed the wheels, but for now I'm just gonna keep it as it is. Okay. At least we're gonna see where we were. Where we drove. Okay, let's stop here and let's see how this fertilizing went. Okay, this one, this one. We remove needs plowing and lime. Oh, we have only middle part left there. So let's see if we can do that without destroying many of uh, the crops we already destroyed. Yeah, I'm gonna have to change the tires. Uh, let, let's finish this field as it is and we're gonna consider uh, what are our options for changing the tires. And uh, let's go through the middle. Okay, now let's try to follow the same path, but uh, obviously that's not gonna work. Okay, okay uh, one second. Right, since we had some money from uh, selling the, <coughs> since we had some money from selling the fertilizer spreader, I actually leased this machine here. Uh, we do need it because there's no other option of maintaining your vehicles on this map except with this. So I'm gonna do this here, and I'm gonna customize this uh, vehicle. I'm just gonna put narrow tires. And uh, there you go. Okay. Uh, that should be better. Now let's see how this copes with. Uh... with the crop destruction. Oh, wrong way around. Wrong way around. I'm gonna hit this one. No, I won't. I'm gonna hit this one. No, I won't. Okay. Well, let's go back. Okay. We destroyed a lot of crops here. Unfortunately, this is this is how. Uh, things are and unfortunately we're gonna have to deal with that we have to learn from it and uh, we need to cope with that so uh, we're gonna try to apply two fertilizing stages for the leader um, for 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 a bit later we're gonna have a couple of other uh, tactics we're gonna try to use uh, concerning these fields uh, it's gonna be uh, weeding it's gonna be um, Mulch hero, the one I had in FS17. If I can, if if it's transferred to FS19, uh, we're gonna do, uh, do the mulch harrowing as well, harrowing because that's a metal tech um, machine. That's a Polish company, and it's gonna fit perfectly into this map, even though it's a little bit big. I believe seven or nine meters width. Oh. Okay, let's see how we did with this one. Okay, this one is next to perfect. I think we'll, um, there's a little bit left on the big, bigger field, but um, I'm not gonna deal with that now. Okay, let's get this one back into the shed, Caverna Land, and uh, let's see what, what else we can do 
uh, on this map. Um, I was thinking of getting uh, some mission or something, but uh, uh, we don't have enough land. It doesn't justify even the machinery we have now. Uh, this land, we're gonna be done working on it in a few seconds, so I'm not gonna... Uh, we need more fields. That's where this story was going. So we need more fields. Okay, so let's see what we can buy here. Let's buy something that we can uh, work on straight away. So if we go to filters, if we go to fruit types, let's see what's ripe. Field number 12, there is something that we can uh, deal with. That's barley, proper beer, Polish beer barley. Uh, what else we have? This is a remove tops. So I'm not gonna deal with that. We have field number 13. What is on field number 13? That's oats. That's also something to consider. Let's see how the field, field prices go. Okay, so this is a bit more expensive. These three fields is definitely something that's in our reach. And let's see what else, sorry about that. Let's see what else is on field 11 and two. Perfect, they're all uh, cereal crops, everything that we can harvest with the machinery we have right now. So I think this is the, the best choice is to uh, purchase this field. So let's see go to this one this one and let's just check what else ah, poop what else we have here all of these fields are ready to be harvested uh, they are a bit pricey those two are a bit cheaper uh, this is a bit pricey well, this is affordable here <clears throat> and it's quite close to the sell point uh, let's see if uh, anything here is ready to harvest so we have two fields ready to harvest um, but what they are cotton and canola now I think we're gonna go with uh, three fields here so I think they are the best choice for us so let's do this what about this yeah I think it's settled uh, we're buying these fields yes and uh, I'm gonna leave this tractor here and I'm gonna go and get our harvester and I'm gonna and, and let's get cracking. I want to start cracking, right? So let's see here. Uh, lift. We need to go all the way around. Oh, it's gonna be perfect. Okay. I'm not the biggest fan of this harvester, but on the other hand, I, I don't mind it as well. So, so it's fine. For me, it's fine. Uh, we need to check the fertilizing stages of the fields, other fields that we have. And also, by um, harvesting this field, this is going to give us uh, open on much more options that we can do. Uh, fortunately, there's nowhere to sell the straw. And can I disable that? I think I have to do this. Let's see if this is better. No, I don't think this harvester has an option to... Let, let's check this one more time. So if we go to F1 and turn off the header... No, 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 it looks like this one doesn't have... Doesn't have... Uh, we cannot disable the straw, so well, that's fine, that's fine. We'll, we'll, we'll manage. Let's try to do headlands one more time. Oh, one more time. It's actually gonna be one time headlands and we are done. There we go. Here we go. Okay. Well, it's a really small field, so it's hard to navigate around it. Uh, not a lot of uh, room on the sides of the field, uh, which is what I like. I like challenging the maps. Uh, we have to see how we're going to deal with this one here. I don't think we're going to be able to harvest... Um, ...this thing here. Maybe a little bit on this side, and then a little bit on the other side. Go. Oh, the, the pole is not uh, solid. Oh, okay. Well, that makes it a little bit easier, but I'm gonna try it anyway to avoid the pole. Okay. Let's go like 
this. Here we go. Okay, uh, we're gonna finish this field pretty fast, and I don't think we're gonna even fill the harvester once. Um, I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. I need to sell this as soon as possible. Um, well, I, I have nothing to do with it except sell it because we don't have a silo on this map, so uh, it's gonna be unloading and selling, and we can conclude this initial episode of um, of uh, Polska VS Vies. So start of Polska Vies, and uh, in the next episode we're gonna make a plan what we have to do. There's those fields that need to be fertilized, the new ones that we bought. Hopefully they are, well, maybe they are fertilized already, I didn't even check. Okay. Yeah, let's do that, let's do that. I, I think we can fit it in one pass, but uh, I think I'm gonna try it in two, so let's see what we can do here. Okay, 48%, <laughs> that's way less than I expected, but uh, also I don't think this field was fertilized at all. Let's check what we have here. So this field is now fertilized, the other two, two and 11. Oh, 11 is fertilized fully, that's really nice. And none of them need plowing, all of them need lime. I'm gonna skip the lime, <clears throat> plowing is definitely something that we're gonna do. We'll see what we can do with that. Um, right. Okay. Let's go back. Um, definitely, plowing is going to plowing is a thing, and we're going to do plowing. Um, probably, maybe we'll see for the next episode. I might change some equipment we have. Um, those things being uh, probably a tractor. Uh, I'm going to try to find something modded, maybe more appropriate for this map. I'm not saying that Fiat is not appropriate, but maybe we can do. Uh, well, something a little bit more authentic. I mean, we have that four sheet tractor um, that uh, I, I uh, used in the initial episode. There we go. In the map review episode, maybe that four sheet would be a better option for this map. Uh, I'll do a little bit of research to see what. Uh, other people are saying about four sheet tractors in Poland. Maybe uh, they're not so common there. Oh. Okay, let's try this way. Right. Need to squeeze out that trailer. Is it gonna go? Really? There we go. Okay, let's go and unload this one. Let's remove the. Let's remove the cover. And uh, let's unload this, uh, what was it, barley? Yes, Polish beer barley. Okay, uh, let's see what other fields we did have here. This is barley, maybe I should wait for another barley to be ripe for harvesting. Before I sell it, but it's gonna take a while, it's still not on the last stage. <laughs> Look at my driving here, it's horrible, horrendous. Okay. Okay, this is done. Hmm. What's the price of the barley now? You know what? I don't think I'm gonna sell the barley now. Uh, I'm just gonna put it away. So we're gonna cover this one. I'm gonna put it back in the shed. I'm gonna start using the other shed because this one is okay. It's working, it's working. That's when it usually it stops working. There we go. Okay, that's I'm gonna disconnect it this way. I was thinking also about manual uh, manual disconnect mode. Guys, tell me in the comment section what do you think about that and uh, uh, what do you think about me using that, that on a regular basis. But um, anyway, uh, we're gonna conclude this episode. And we're gonna. I'm gonna say thank you for watching. Uh, if you didn't by now, please do subscribe and uh, let me know if what you think about the map, about the series, about uh, well, the, this map, uh, this modder had another nice mods because this map is really beautiful. 
guys thank you for watching subscribe like uh, leave a nice comment in the comment section uh, click the notification bell to see every episode we have and that's for a while now at least once a day thank you for watching and see you in the next one bye bye